Back so soon? What's the rush? Okay, okay, sit down, shut up, and pay attention. The misfit vault hunters had discovered the secret location of the Gortis project, but getting there wouldn't be easy. Hyperion had not forgotten about the renegade employees, and the native Pandoran wildlife was, uh, just getting to know them. They escaped with their lives, but not much else. Out in the wasteland, the former middle manager discovered Handsome Jack riding shotgun in his brain while having a shotgun pointed at his head. Fancy meeting you a too. precarious position, to be sure, but nothing compared to the con artist. The price on her head had attracted all kinds of thugs and gunmen. You'd think that would have been the end of her story. But hey, you never know when a polite reprogrammed killing machine will drop in and save the day. Was she bothering you? Back on the trail of the Gortis project, they found a wondrous hidden city, risen from the corpse of a ghost town. But unfortunately, their moment of awe and victory was to be the advantage of their opponents. <laughs> Gently. Taken hostage and forced to surrender the keys to the kingdom, they had to go all in on one last gamble. This chapter of the story begins with the questionable choice to trust the Pandoran Hustler. Must have been a tough decision. What, he's supposed to trust the psychopath? At least the psychopath had a plan. That's fair. Why did you choose Fiona? Especially when you consider your obsession with Jack. <laughs> he still doesn't think of it as an obsession. Well, I trusted her. I mean, what can I say? She never gave me a reason not to. Thanks. Hmm. That's interesting. They were a team. It's an easy call. I mean, when, when it gets tough, you stick with your team in a situation like that. It was the only choice. Obviously, it wasn't. Look, someone had to take the initiative. It wasn't like there were a lot of options. <laughs> I don't suppose there's a spare for the spare. Well, if there is, I'm not changing it this time. We're close. We can walk it from here. Where the hell is here? Yeah. And why is it where we are? I'll tell you when I find what we're looking for. So, what happened next? Well, things started out fine. Oh, okay, so this was your plan. Just give me a light so I can see what I'm doing. Fine, here. Let's move. Well, where are we? Where are we even going? Because we are not helping them right now. No idea. Oh, good. We have to get back there. Vaughn and Sasha- I know. Um, Fiona? Yeah. Gary. What's going <clears throat> Shut up. on? You find anything yet? Nah. Gary's dead. Who? Gary. Oh, right. Just find them and we can put an end to all this. Well, already ended for Gary. Stay here. Yeah, I'll stay here and look after the ball. <clears throat> Hey, 
Hey, just come out, all right? Honestly, I, I will probably hurt you. So how quickly you come out will probably have to do with how much I hurt you. So if you come out quick, then dandy. Just getting that out there. Yeah, I did that once. You want to get in there real good tight. <clears throat> yeah, heard that didn't go so great. What? You should... Um... Was, hey, over there or something. Damn it, Reese! Keep your head down! Oh, you think I'm sticking my head up again after that? No, I'll tell you when to go, okay? I got it. You, I, I go when you say so. Now! Go! Go! Ah! Oh, give me that. Hands off! Ah, <laughs> 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 oh, shit! Are you okay? Yeah. We can get up to the lobby from back here. No, we need Gordas first. You didn't get it? Focus, Reese. We need Gordas back or this whole thing's shot. But how? Got it all planned out. You throw your hat at exactly the right time so that the turrets shoot each other and blow up. We don't have much time. Who knows how long Vasquez will keep Sasha and Vaughn around. Not bad, Reese. Well, I have my moments. One, so far. I had more. You just weren't around. Touch goal! Or sh shit, I don't know. I'm happy! <laughs> Touch goal? Touch goal? Shut up! Take this. I'll give you a boost. It's the arm and the ice cream. How are you so weak? Come on! Maybe if you'd help me. Becomes what is. Oh! Who's there fake now? Witness! Yeah, baby. I'm not trying to be all braggy, but I was pretty awesome back. What the crap? Ow! I can't Come on! Come on, buddy, talk to me! Crap. Loaderbot, would you mind? We can't move! We can't move! Okay! Important. Uh, look around anxiously twice if you're still breathing. We'll figure it out when we get out of here. Okay, well, hopefully we can still get him out of here. Hey, I'm open to suggestions here, guys. Do you have an extra gun? Get put. 
Pushing on that statue. Sash, let's go. If I were you, I'd be taking all the help I could get right now. <sighs> you the leader of this outfit? Hey, you all right there, buddy? <laughs> oh, right, cause the... yeah. That's right. What of it? Cheeky. There she is. You remember me? Great. These jackasses. Oh, she remembers, all right. Oh, yeah. You look, uh, different. I look different, because you made me look different. <laughs> yeah, man, she knows. She's messing with all you, right, dude. that's enough! Calm down, Finch. She's the one who shot the shit out of me. Oh, yeah, she did. Please. Just let me shoot that girl back in the face. Get in the truck. Just You're being a nuisance. Me too. But man, I didn't even. So man, what is it that you want you exactly? Me in trouble. Fee. Hmm. I see why you're Felix's favorite. Don't be surprised. I've known about you two for as long as you've been lifting watches. But I'm out ten million bucks cause someone turned a simple deal into a complete shit show. Someone has to pay for that. <sighs> Looks like we have a couple new contestants. This isn't good. Okay, okay, I know how it looks. Things got a little messed up, but- Shut up! I I'll deal with you later. I just want to say I had nothing to do with this. Uh-huh. Who's to blame here, Fiona? I want a name. Calm down, Hugo. No, no. I just... Like, I just need her to know. She's gonna say it, it was my fault, and it's Give not... Give me a name. And you make... You want to know who's to blame. That's... why we're all standing here. Felix. This is all Felix's fault. But he's not here, is he? That doesn't change that he's to blame. Look! I know you're super pissed, but we've got the Gordy's thing, and it is gonna get us a vault that is worth way more than ten million bucks, just like we told you. Everything is fine! We're fine! So this is what all the fuss is about. Yeah. Yeah. That's our little moneymaker. Huh? Then I guess I don't need you anymore. What? No! Oh! 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 Ah! I suppose I don't need any of you. I thought it was a flashbang grenade. Uh, it is. That's not how it works. 
And that's not how it went. She put that gun in your face and you would all... Keep talking. The truth this time. Fine. But where was I? <laughs> you were in the middle of this. I was getting Gordas back. Here, we gotta go. This isn't over. You're the one leaving. Looks over to me. No, it'll feel much different than this. I let you know when it happens. <laughs> Are you all just completely stupid? You're not getting Gordas. What? What? I am here to help you. You idiots! Oh. This is easily the most annoying contract I've ever taken. Oh, at least if it was an assassination, I'd have the pleasure of a kill at the end of it. Oh, well, I'm so sorry for the inconvenience. Who even hired you? A man named Felix. I normally don't divulge that kind of information, but he wanted you to know. What did he hire you for, exactly? Felix wanted me to pass along some knowledge, to mentor you, to help you survive. He felt you two had some untapped potential. You couldn't have told us this earlier? It's not exactly something you scream down an alley when you've got Valerie's goons running around. My work requires some discretion. Oh, discretion. When you say that, are you referring to the part where you were chasing us through Hollow Point, trying to behead us with your shield? If I wanted to behead you, it would have happened. Whoa, don't be mad we got away. Thanks for stepping in, with Valerie. Sure, don't mention it. Ugh, look, I know you two have been through a lot, but I assure you I'm here to help. And I don't anticipate that'll be very long, because when I feel the contract is filled, I'll be out of your lives. So let's just get through this. Well... Welcome aboard, I guess. Thank you. So, uh... What's up with your friend? <laughs> He's quiet now. Which is nice. Vaughn got shot by some incapacitating bullet or something. But other than that, though, he... He seems fine. Ish. Yeah, that was probably a poor choice. <laughs> oh, yeah! I think I got something. What you got? I don't know, but I, I found out there's an on button somewhere. You've been looking at that thing for like 20 minutes. Well, it's apparently very small. Initiating Gorta's startup sequence. Energy chassis required for Vault of the Traveler protocol. Loading coordinates for energy chassis. Gortis activated. Happy birthday. Hi! Wow! Hey! Really great to meet you all. I think I was expecting something... different? Hi, Gortis. Welcome to the group. Thank you! I'm so happy to be here! This is all really exciting! Awesome! Awesome! Awesome. Awesome. Your friend is crying. Is he crying because he's sad or because he's happy? <sighs> I think he's crying because he can't blink. Oh! We should 
probably get him some you know, eye drops or something. Oh, cool! You got another robot! It's very nice to meet you. How is your day going? It's a mixed bag. That's great! Variety is so important. Gordis, hi. Hi! Why don't you tell us a little bit about yourself? Okay, where to start? Now, I don't know every detail, but I was created by Atlas as a last-ditch effort to get to the riches of a vault to get a leg up on those Hyperion guys. Well, we are still number one. Atlas had facilities all over Pandora working on the pieces of me to get it done faster. But then, that lady made it a little more difficult to assemble by killing every Atlas employee. Well, uh, how many more pieces are there? No idea, but the next piece we need is... Uh... Oh, that away! Okay, let's do this. Great! Oh, that's a great idea. Everybody up and at them! Come on, slowpoke! Time's all wasted! Uh, Gordis? Hmm? He is, um... Oh, he's got, um, some stomach issues. Oh, I can see that. Well, hope you feel better. Hey, shit. Uh, just checking in. Don't want to distract you from the victory lap. You're probably taking now that Vasquez is dead, but, uh, you haven't told Athena about me at all, have you? Oh, uh, why do you ask? Because if she finds out about me, she'll cut your frickin' head off before you can even explain yourself. I'm not exaggerating. This chick's nuts. She really, really doesn't like me. Oh. Okay, look, kiddo. Stop calling me kiddo, please. Who are you talking to? Uh, I... <laughs> and... Ow! 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 Sorry, 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 but I mean it. She's really gonna kill us. Hey, what, what, what do you say we go to the room? Mossport? The nice, warm, vault hunter free room. <laughs> I suddenly need to go to the roof. Listen, you're probably gonna die, you know that, right? And I'm not talking about Athena here, I'm, I'm just saying, like, in general. General sort of impending death. Oh, okay. Is this about me not letting you take over my cybernetics? Yeah, it's about that. You trusted that floozy with a flashbang over your old pal Jack here, and look where I got you. I could have grabbed that drone before he turned your buddy into a code rack. I am uh, detecting a little lack of trust here, pal. What's going on, Tick Tock? <laughs> it's just me. I didn't feel like giving over control of myself to a mass-murdering megalomaniac. Firstly, hurtful. Secondly, nice alliteration. Thirdly, if I'm a mass murderer, what does that make you? <laughs> what? How many bandits do you think you've killed so far, Sport? Huh? A dozen? Two dozen? No, 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 no. Th th those were all in self-defense. Hey, like 75... 70% 70 of all the people I've killed were too. Look, you don't trust me, I get it. But let me spoil the big secret about surviving on Pandora for you. It's not about who's got the biggest gun, it's about team. More than that, it's about compromise. If you're old pal Vasquez had just given you your promotion, he wouldn't be dead, would he? Says the dead guy. Yeah, all right, sure. Yeah, you know what? Let's talk about that. You know why I died? Why is that guy talking to himself? He's going through some things. Well, because Vault... Because I didn't work with the people I didn't trust. But I just thrown stock options at the Vault Hunters instead of bullets. I'd be on a beach right now, doing disturbingly graphic things with the local 
And if you can't learn to work with the people you want to punch in the throat, well, you're, you're gonna die. With nothing but your pride and a big, fat hole in your sternum. It sucks. This shit hurts. Well, if I'm gonna die anyway, I'd rather die a good guy. Oh, is that so? Because if you want, I can overload the neurons to your brain right now. Uh, no, 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 no. <laughs> it's just, I'm just kidding. I'm messing with you. I totally can't do that. No, or can I? Nah, I can't. No, it's just me to do. You want to live. No, that's good. That's good. What the hell is that? I'm detecting some tension here. It's a bummer. We should be pals. You know? I actually see a lot of myself in you. And I know I've done some kind of <laughs> things, but we're a team here, kiddo. And you can even ask Athena. I always look out for my team, so I'm just asking you, trust me here. We've got so much in common. I blackmailed and murdered my way up the Hyperion ladder. You came up with that sick vault key deal. Huh? I, I don't know how much clearer I can be, you, you genocidal maniac. I do not trust you. Huh. Oh, so that's how it is, huh? Well, that's fine. You know, I've been all torn up about our little arrangement here, and are we friends, are we not? Uh, this, this just makes things so very, very simple. Enjoy that body while it's still yours. <laughs> yes, sir. Well, that's surprising. I didn't know you had it in you. Guys, can we just call it for the night? We're not gonna find anything in this light. Yeah. All right. Your mask. What about it? It hides your identity. That is the definition of a mask, yes. What of it? You don't plan to kill us, do you? Why do you say that? I'm thinking you wouldn't go through the trouble of hiding your face if you were. Impressive. That is correct. I don't plan on it. But that can change. No. None of the lines I put you on make any sense without you either knowing us or needing us. It's compelling theory. How confident are you in this hunch? What I mean is, do you care to make a wager? I don't make bets when I don't know the outcome. Just thinking out loud. You should do a little less of that. Tell me about the dome. I'm done talking for a while. He can fill you in. Hey! What? He wants to know about the dome. Well, the creepy part or the pretty part? All of it. This is incredible. Yeah, yeah, I guess so. Desert, ice, and now this. I have never seen anything like it before. And this is where the upgrade thingy is? So close! This is definitely a little weird. What the hell is this place?
<laughs> we made it. Entrance this way. Let's see what else this place has to offer. Is creepometer going bananas right now? <laughs> Lord about what did he say? Unclear. I am unable to translate paralytic grunts. So my upgrade's nearby. Sorry, it's kind of spooky in here. You know, just once I'd like to search an abandoned health spa or something with fluffy towels. Gordis, can you scan the room for, you know? Danger. Uh, could you please describe to me how you think that would work? Well, your sensors kind of like sweep the room's vectors. I mean, that was a totally valiant effort. But no, it doesn't work like that at all. Well, we know your upgrade is nearby. Let's let's look around in here, Mortis. Mortis! Don't kill me. Please, please don't kill me. I, I, I've just been watching you. Just, just watching, that's all. I swear, I am completely harmless. There is absolutely no need for you to kill me. I, I assure you. No one's killing anyone. But you need to calm the hell down or up your meds, okay? Of course. Of course. I just don't uh, run into many people on my travels. In fact, I rather make it a point not to. Hey there! That little robot's why we're here. There's an upgrade somewhere nearby. We're looking for it. Well, I, I, I can't help you with that. I know nothing about it. So, you should leave. We all should leave, all of us, going our separate ways. I can leave right now, in fact, and if anyone asks, not that... Anyone would, of course. I, I'll tell them. I'll say, I didn't see you. All right, two things. You're A, really weird, and B, obviously hiding something. What is it? I... I just... I... I... Um... Oh, uh, your, your friend there. Does he happen to suffer from artificially induced hemispherical abdomission? Paralysis? Yeah, that's a good question, Vaughn. Why didn't you just say paralysis? Because he's not technically paralyzed. Uh, the contortion, the blinkless eyes, all signs of a toxin called Thanatopsol. Wait, 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 you've seen this before? Yes, if you let me get a better look at him. No, wait, you were just ready to book out of here. Now you want to stay? <laughs> Excuse me, Fiona, but the good doctor here... We have no idea if he's a doctor. Let's just assume that he is. Help me get your friend on the table. There, good. Bully, here we are. Actually, young lady, I could use your help. Uh, yeah. Okay. What am I doing with this? You're plunging it into his heart. So... what now? I don't know. I've never done anything like this before. Uh, what? I thought you knew- <laughs> Someone please spit in my eye! Or lick! Lick my eye! I don't care! Lick oh me God, in the eye! Oh God, the toxin turned him insane. Or into an eyeball fetishist. He's dehydrated. But the shot you gave him should help. Oh, oh, oh man. Oh, that's the stuff. Oh, <laughs> Thank you for blinking. Oh, God. Well, glad I could help. Well, hang on there, Doc. If that is your real name. It's not, and I never said it was. Well, I'm not done with you yet. There's no need for you to be this suspicious, surely. But I just helped him. <sighs> Very well. Uh, 
I'm on the run, you see. I have lost everything. My wife. My son. My cat. I did not lose them in that order, though. I, I lost my wife first, then my cat, then my son. So, wife, cat, son. You ever thought of becoming a professional storyteller? Because I gotta tell you, your sense for crucial information is just... Reese. Forgive me. It's been a long time since I've enjoyed human contact. Uh, perhaps I've forgotten how to talk to people. You must understand, I've suffered months of wandering, isolation, skulking from one location to the next, broken, ashamed, homeless. I got here, to this place, only minutes ago, so... I'd ask that you leave me now, to my demons, and go. That's a sad story, but I still don't trust him. Me neither. I do! Is that dumb of me? I saw your map, which I assume you made while exploring this facility. I have no idea what you're talking about. Oh, no? So maybe you won't mind if I... No! Don't do that! To that uh, is map, is it? Uh, that I've never seen before? Just fond of paper. You know, you seem like an intelligent man. You've probably figured out by now that the easiest way to end all this and get rid of us is simply tell the truth. Proposal accepted, young lady. The bunker within that jungle. I suspect it contains the upgrade you're looking for. I wish I could tell you more about what's inside, but I was never brave enough to check. The problem, your problem is the Atlas automated security system that surrounds said bunker. Isn't it always? If I were you, and in this instance I'm relieved I am not, I'd gain access to the security tower, which is... there. <laughs> I can get in and disable the security systems. Easy. Not easy. Not at all easy. But your best option nonetheless. Automated security system, huh? Huh. Just realized the acronym for that is ASS! Ha! What kind of defenses are we talking about here? Oh, the usual medley of turrets and laser grids. Self-regulated, self-controlling, all lethal, of course. Reese, that sounds like something you can handle, right? Please, in my sleep. So we're done talking, then? We can actually go secure this upgrade now? Fiona. While Mr. Robot Eye here hits the security tower and hacks the defenses, you and I will infiltrate the bunker and grab the upgrade. Let's get this gorgeous piece and get out of here, huh? Awesome! This is incredible! Confidence. That's good. Okay, little update from me, uh, which is... I feel terrible! Not good at all. And I'm sure I've got some residual nerve damage. Oh, almost certainly you do. Right, thank you for that input. So, I'm gonna maybe chill out here? That's cool with everyone? Uh, yeah. That's okay. I'll go with Reese. There's a lot of stuff I can do, right? Huh? I mean, I don't have a robot eye. I'm not a highly trained assassin. Also not particularly charming, but but I can still do stuff. Yeah, I, I, I can do it. I'll, I'll figure out something to do back here while you're gone. Have fun, everyone. Being awesome, I guess. And work with Gordis while we're gone. Figure out exactly how our upgrades work. I can do that. Yeah! Vaughn is the best! Alright. Everyone knows what they're doing? Yeah. Uh -huh. And with a plan like this, what could possibly go wrong? So, despite my incredible leadership efforts going unnoticed, Sasha and I went to go brave the catwalks and find the security station. How are you not permanently damaged from all this brain trauma? I'm perfectly fine, thank you. I've got a tough noggin. Just ask Vasquez. Or... never mind. Huh. Hmm. Huh. Hmm. <laughs> perfectly fine, huh? Huh. <laughs> Thank you. 
You're not as useless as I first thought. I mean, when I first saw you guys, I thought, wow, no wonder Hyperion isn't what it used to be. <laughs> well, I appreciate that. I know it's a hard thing for you to say. And I appreciate you appreciating it. <laughs> you know, when I first saw you at the deal with the uh, nose ring boy, I thought, uh, these two don't know what the hell they're doing. You weren't wrong about that. Were you two close? No, but he thought we were. August was a mark. Nothing more, nothing less. Ooh, nothing less? I don't know why I said that part. I felt like I was supposed to. You spend a certain amount of time with someone. You get to see a side of them you might not have been expecting. Oh, right. So what you're saying is he was really into guns. Exactly. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> it's just so... Beautiful? Yeah. I've never seen anything like it. Me either. Let's see where this goes. Just thinking the same thing. <laughs> okay, we are pretty high. You have a problem with heights? Sometimes. Just most, mostly when I look down. <laughs> well then, don't look down. Don't be scared. I won't let you fall. Okay, come on. I believe in you, Reese. Wow, you made that look really easy. Well, that's because it is. <laughs> right. Okay, go time. <laughs> okay, yeah, that was totally not scary. If you thought that was scary, you should try looking. <laughs> oh! Hope you brought some bug spray. <laughs> Sasha! I'm all right. Don't look down. Okay. And don't puke on me. <laughs> no promises. <laughs> Climb faster. Oh, I'm going as fast as I can. Oh, it's gonna go. Hold tight. <laughs> Just hold on, okay? Gonna take a little longer. Dead! Losing! Strength! Reese, I'm letting go. There's no way you're getting up that with me hanging on you. No! No, Sasha! I won't let you go! You have to trust me! Now get us out of this! It's okay, Sasha. Reese. Sasha! No! Wow, we are really close to the ground, aren't we? You sure know how to make things dramatic. I mean, t to be fair, you, you, you did tell me not to look down. Well, you can drop down now. Yep, okay. <laughs> okay, you can you, get down now. Yeah, down. And for the record, I didn't let you fall. Whew, we made it. I'm, uh, I'm glad that you didn't plummet to your death. Aw, me too, buddy. So, right. The turret controls we need to get to are back up there. Guess we'll take the scenic route.
It's just trees. I just... I can't believe this. This... This jungle is incredible. I forget that this is new for you. Come on. The Gordis upgrade is that way. What? <gasps> what the hell is that thing? That is an opportunity. <laughs> what are you packing? That little sleeve pistol? You're going to need more than that. Yep. Sucks. Who walks around Pandora with a gun that can only carry one bullet? Felix put training wheels on this thing. He was holding you back. What, was he scared I'd hurt myself? There. No more elemental burnout. And if you're worried about bullets... What's that? Obviously, it's a bullet. I mean, why are you looking at it like that? A backup plan. Only for emergencies. It's your lucky bullet. Everyone has a bullet out there with their name on it. If you're lucky, the one you got there is yours. So keep it close. You don't want it coming back to you. Now you take it down! <gasps> It's going to kill you! You should do something! Yeah, I don't think you're exactly doing a great job of protecting me so far. That plan didn't kill you. And once you're a proper vault hunter, little annoyances like that will continue to not kill you. Over and over again. You keep calling me vault hunter, but I'm not like you. I can't throw a shield or go invisible. My one talent involves talking at people until they get confused. We don't all get to choose our talents, Fiona. Look at me. Do you think I would have chosen a shield to protect myself out here? I learned to make do. You've spent your entire life outthinking your enemies. Do that now. See the outcomes before you act. <laughs> Wasn't so hard, was it? You think so? Hmm. Fiona the Vault Hunter. I kinda like it. Come on. The sooner we can upgrade Gordis, the sooner we can leave. After a while, you just sort of feel like you've seen everything. Like you can't be surprised by anything anymore. Okay, so I'm, I'm going to stick this on your head. And, and, and please don't stab me. Okay... And there you go. Oh, thanks. How do I look? <laughs> what the hell is that? This is why we can't have anything nice. Red means bad, right? Oh. 
Uh, Breeze, there's no power. Hang on! I think I can jumpstart it! Oh, good. This is slow, too. Huh. This is weird. There. Ugh, what the hell? I thought Reese was taking care of this. You can handle this on your own. Oh crap. Hi, Janie. Athena? Where are you? Go on. Uh-huh. I know that. <clears throat> Gotta run. Another delivery. I... I'll see you soon. Bye-bye. Oh, that sounded... uncomfortable. That was my girlfriend, Springs. She... doesn't know I still do the vault hunting and adventuring and everything. It's not that I want to lie to her. She just... Worries. Maybe you should just tell her the truth. Let's just keep moving. Looks like this piece of tin could probably be popped right off if we yanked hard enough. Ideas? Oh, hang on. I got this. Is that an eye? Uh-huh. Why are you carrying an eye around in your pocket? I thought it might come in handy. Welcome, General Pollux. See? It came in handy. That is so weird. Your carrying that around is the weirdest thing I have ever seen, and I have seen a lot. It is not that Oh weird. my god! Yes. Yes, it is. That's beautiful. Yeah, good drop. Let's grab it and go. Oh, wow. Okay. Whatever you gotta do, you should probably do it faster than you were planning. Yeah. There we go! Oh, crap. Sasha, look at this. He's an... Atlas scientist? Oh, this is not good. Come on! Of course. <clears throat> We're safe behind that shield, right? Until it runs out of energy and we're both shot to death! Yes! I am gonna kill that Hyperion! Grab the Gordon's upgrade. Quick!
I guess this is the energy chassis. Any idea what it does? It gets us one step closer to a vault. Is it worth it? Constantly risking your life trying to find out what's inside of a vault? Hell yeah it is. And I miss it. I know I made a promise to Janie, but... The thrill. There's nothing like it. Come on. Let's get this thing back so it can do... whatever it does. This is what you've been looking for? Yes. Oh, man. Okay, what are the odds that you'd find that piece just as Fiona told that part of the story? Just lucky, I guess. Sure. Lucky. Uh-huh. What do you want with that thing, huh? Clearly you know what happened. If I knew everything, you wouldn't be here. I'm saying I would have killed you. Uh, yeah, we get it. Oh, you made it! <laughs> awesome! Hey, so that thing you wanted me to look into? The upgrade? Yeah, I found out it's some sort of energy chassis. That doesn't mean anything to me. Well, I guess it's some sort of ring that fits around Gordis and allows her to digistruct. Huh. You've returned. And with the Gordis upgrade, no less. Huzzah! I take it that you'll be on your way then. <laughs> no point dawdling in a crummy, rundown facility like this. Time must be of the essence, isn't it? And you need to be off to the next part of your adventure. You do realize we're still waiting on two more. Yeah, we're not about to ditch our friends. No, right. Of course not. Well, perhaps I should be the one to leave then. What happened? Um, oh, Reese just took a spill. He's, he's totally fine. He's took a spill. Fine. Oh, good. We learned something. About Cassius. Why are you looking at me? He works for Atlas. You lying Atlas shit! Whoa, whoa! What are you doing? Filling an obligation. Why is everyone so excited? What's happening? I knew this day would eventually come. <laughs> you sure took your time. Well, your wait will soon be over. So who are you? Really? Cassius. Dr. Cassius Leclerc. I ran this facility. As far as I'm aware, I am the last remaining Atlas employee on Pandora. And you're the last to die. Wait! Why are you doing this? Because... Because Atlas tricked me into killing my own sister. Okay? What would you do if that happened to you? I'd burn everything to the ground. The only thing that kept me from doing that was focusing my anger to rid the world of Atlas, to avenge my sister. And that is why I have to kill but you. But he didn't have anything to do with that. It's okay. No, it's not. I'm Atlas too. Am I next? It's different. Athena, stop. I can't. You don't understand. I made a vow! You didn't make that to her. You made it to yourself, and you're acting like there's no choice. You don't have to do this. I am sorry for what happened to your sister. Thank you. No! Quiet! <laughs> ah! Holy crap, what was that? Athena! Of course. Huh? What is going on? Oh, well, what's going on is you finally finding out what happens when you trust your friends over me.
Hey, kid, remember me? Grab him. So, where's Gordas? Now you all have a habit of making me ask twice. I'd knock that off if I were you. Piss off. One for these jerk bags. I, I would yank that rocket launcher off your shoulder and just smack you with it. Sounds fun. Let him go. Uh, <laughs> Is that my Gordis stuck in that loader bot? August! I got it! Are you sassing me, son? You said get it, and I said I got it. How's that sassing? It was your tone. One. My tone is of a person sick of chasing these assholes. But like I said, I got it. This is an outrage. Let me speak to your manager. Well, this looks bad. I'm just gonna go ahead and hang out in the back of your brain in case it somehow doesn't get the crap killed out of it. Peace. Oh, your friends can't hear you, girl. Oh, no, wait. Where's oh. the... <laughs> you looking for this? Guess you must have misplaced it. Now, I don't know what this thing is, but you obviously want it. And that kind of makes me obviously want it. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> Hmm. Whoopsies, sucker. <laughs> what? You think we stupid or something? Ain't nobody pulling that crap on me again. So, when you took it from me, you must have realized that Derringer is a remote-activated grenade, right? Got a transmitter implanted in my tooth. What? Whoa! Ha! <laughs> What the? Man, what is that? You see something? Will you give me a second, dude? Damn. Hurry up, man. <laughs> man, just blast the bush and be done with it. I don't want to get ambushed. I'm the one that'll get ambushed, man. What's your problem? <laughs> what the? By the way, yeah, well, I've been practicing. Now get me out of here. Uh, yeah. Oh, oh shit. shit. <sighs> Sorry, Fee. That's what I'm talking about. Think you're so damn tough? Damn it! Help! The help would be good! Wait! Just give me I am so nauseous right now. Face me! Athena? Sounds like she's in trouble. Greetings. 
Have you seen Gorky's? They went that way. My thanks is eternal. Wait, Blotterbot, hold up! Where are you going? Well, we need to get Gordas back. You help out Athena, I'll go drag Reese's ass out of the fire. Again. You gonna be okay? Yeah. You give him hell. <laughs> give him hell? That's that's what you're going with. Just don't die, and try to kill a lot of people. That I can do. Later, Fee. Pretty impressive. I know. Come on, let's get Gordis back. Keep it safe. Here, Gordis will need it. I'll take care of this. Keep the Gordis piece from Finch and Kroger. Got it. Atta boy. Wait, what are you gonna do? I'm gonna stop the truck. How? I don't know, just cover me. With what? You'll figure it out. Hey. Ah. That's a bad thing. Order back. We gotta get rid of that gunner. Get me in close. Anything for you. Piece of- ah! 
Athena. I don't know you, but you really ought to run. This is bald hunter business. Ain't no reason for you to get caught in the crossfire. <laughs> Unless you're holding a lot of sweet loot anyway. I am a vault hunter. <laughs> All right, whatever you say. <laughs> This is going to be fun. What the hell? My scams! Hey! So people are still trying to kill us. What do we do? Help us! Cake and your new leg thingies to get us out of this somehow! Don't know. Maybe. Looks like the cavalry's here, asswipe. Time to go! Oh no, you don't! Later, jackass! Enjoy <laughs> the flight! This is gonna be bad. Here comes the pain train! Woo -woo! Who the hell are you? Pinky toe. Come here.
I never thought of you as the caring type, Athena. <sighs> kill you. You hear me? Not today, little girl. Not today. Wait. Where's Vaughn? I... I don't know. Vaughn? Vaughn! <laughs> when you have to get rid of a vault hunter, just bring in two vault hunters. You boys got everything? Yes, ma'am. Lilith will be real happy to see this wretched piece of assassin trash hauled in. You needed Athena as much as I needed her out of my hair. I'm glad we were able to help each other out. Do you feel that, Athena? Now, it's over. That is one scary lady. Be quiet, amigo. You want her to hear you? So, where's the last piece, little one? We have a vault to summon. Leave her alone. Tell me where it is before more of your friends get hurt. Starting with this hunk of scrap right here. Okay. Okay. It... It's there. On Helios. 